The following is a summary of the Holy Father's catechesis at the beginning of this audience. Dear brothers and sisters, continuing our weekly catechesis inspired by this holy year devoted to divine mercy, we now consider God's mercy at work in the history of the chosen people. The scriptures show the Lord's merciful concern for Israel throughout its history, beginning with the call of Abraham. God's mercy is expressed particularly, however, in the experience of the exodus from Egypt. God heard the cry of his people as he hears the cry of the poor and oppressed in every age. He raised up Moses to be the mediator of his mercy and salvation. Through Moses, he led Israel to freedom, and through the covenant, he made them his own possession, a kingdom of priests and a holy nation, a people precious in his eyes. The mystery of God's mercy culminates in the sending of his son, the Lord Jesus, in that new and eternal covenant inaugurated in his blood, whereby we are granted the forgiveness of our sins and become truly God's children, beloved sons and daughters of our good and merciful Father. His Holiness will now greet the pilgrims and visitors who speak English. Saluti pellegrini di lingua inglese presenti all'odierna udienza, specialmente quelli provenienti dagli Stati Uniti d'America. Con fervidi auguri che il presente Giubileo della Misericordia sia per voi e per le vostre famiglie un tempo di grazia e di rinnovamento spirituale. Invoco su di voi la gioia e la pace del Signore Gesù. Dio vi benedica. I greet the English-speaking visitors and pilgrims taking part in today's audience, including those from the United States of America with prayerful good wishes that the present Jubilee of Mercy will be a moment of grace and spiritual renewal, I invoke upon all of you joy and peace in our Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you all. <laughs> 